last guest is one of our seniors. This is Boots, and in addition to um, being a senior, he's also one of our black cats, and he's also one of our shy cats, which can make it a little bit harder for them, um, I say a little bit, it can be a lot harder actually for them to get adopted. Um, the black cats tend to blend in with the stainless steel cages. Um, there's not as many things that set them apart like um, some of the other cats that we've seen on the show today um, with their patterns and their colors. Uh, and then the fact that he's shy means that he's not gonna come out and greet visitors. Um, he sits in his hammock or underneath his hammock and he's perfectly content that way. Um, so he, you know, people often walk by his cage like it's an empty one. Um, but Boots is definitely worth taking a look at. He is a very sweet guy, and once you take the time to slowly introduce yourself to him, he loves attention. He likes to have someone pet him, and he rolls around, and he purrs, and he's just so sweet. And even though he was terrified to come out here today, once he had a nice lap to sit on, he kind of settled in, and um, he's not maybe the most relaxed, but he's definitely much more comfortable. Um, and once he's in a, a home environment where he's, you know, around people he's familiar with, I think this is what you're gonna get with Boots. Um, Boots came to us previously owned, um, and he was surrendered um, to us in April after his owner passed away. Um, the owner had multiple cats. Um, there were too many for family and friends to take care of, so they brought them here to us so that we could find them new forever homes. Um, they do say that he's used to being around primarily women, and I have seen that with a lot of the volunteers that interact with him, they are women, and he's definitely warmed up to them quite quickly, um, and that he's shy, um, which is definitely something that um, is hard to, to miss with, with Boots. But he just needs a little bit of patience, a little bit of TLC, and our volunteers have been working with him uh, daily to get him more acclimated to um, the shelter environment, and he's definitely come a long way from where he was. Um, you know, if you come up to his cage quietly, he will kind of come down. He wants attention, especially if he's familiar with you. Um, so um, he has potential. He just needs um, somewhere safe and loving um, so that he can show his truest version of himself 